No. No way you're getting him, Ethan. You just want him because I want him. Well, I'm not letting you have him. Forget it, Phoebe. Hank is coming with me. Hey, wait a minute. Hey, excuse me, guys. I'm getting confused here. Who's Hank? Hank Aaron. Milwaukee Braves. Oh. His 1954 rookie card. A baseball card? That's what this gets down to is a baseball card. You never loved Hank like I did. You never loved me like you love Hank. What did I ever do Excuse to make me you so Robin? angry? Yes. Yeah. It's time. Why don't you ask oh, yeah. yourself what you did to do? Me. It's a much longer Excuse list. Me. What would you do if you couldn't blame I have to everything pick up my daughter. on me? Oh, you do this in the morning around nine o'clock. Nine sounds Let good. Me think Great. About okay. It. Nine. Oh, well, I'll just, see you then. You, you just try. Okay, Phoebe. I'll see you in the morning. Okay. See how far you. Oh, you're just afraid. I don't need you. Hey, so after a whole day of that, you still want to get engaged? Oh, please. Those people got married on a crazy romantic whim. It's not like that with Nancy and I. Oh, that's right. None of that crazy romantic stuff for you, huh? Oh, come on. I mean, we're rational. Oh. <laughs> no, we've taken the time to understand each other's strengths and weaknesses. Sounds like you're building a bridge. Have you told your daughter yet? No, I haven't. Not yet. But I'm going to tonight. That's the tricky part. I got her present to ease her into it, though. And with yeah. news like this, I hope you got her a Shetland pony. No. Something much better than that. A book? Oh, come on. Don't give me that look. I know it's not that fairy tale book you wanted, but this is better. Look at this. See? Rosa Parks. Madame Curie. She was a remarkable woman who dedicated her life to research until she died from radiation poisoning. She died? Yeah, hi. Tomorrow morning be bright. Yeah. 7.30? Yes, let me call you later. Yeah, all right, bye-bye. It's Nancy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. She's a lot like the woman in your book. Sweetie. I'm gonna ask her to marry me. What? Yeah, you like her, don't you? We all get along, we have a good time together. Where's she going to live? Well, she's going to live with us. Do I have to give up my bedroom? No, you don't have to give up your bedroom, no. Come on, it's going to be great. I promise. It's not like she's going to try and be your mother. I mean, stepmother. Right, she's going to be a nice stepmother. And she's going to take you to school tomorrow, just you and her, for some grown-up girl bonding time. I'm only six. You won't always be. 